Hello everyone, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm Arif, your cloud learning journey partner. In today's video, we're gonna cover a very interesting topic. That is, uh, today we're gonna discuss about top five IT careers in uh, 2023. We all know that the IT industry is always evolving. Every now and then new technologies are emerging. And if we are not aware of this, uh, it's very likely that in few years, the skill set that we have right now will be back kind of like not good enough uh, to get a, a job. So for that reason, you always uh, need to know what's the current trend. In today's video, we're going to cover it all. So today we're going to talk, talk about five specific uh, IT careers that will make sure that you are uh, in a good uh, career path. So before we start in the video, I just want to talk about myself. Well, uh, I'm Arif. I do have more than eight years of experience in cloud computing um, and uh, cybersecurity. I hold multiple certification in AWS, Azure, Google Cloud. Besides that, I also hold CISSP and CISSP certification. You can see my certification in the background. So uh, this channel is all about uh, cloud computing, cybersecurity, and uh, advice related to uh, IT career. So if you're interested in this, this channel is definitely for you. I'm planning to upload a lot of videos in a very frequent manner so please like and subscribe to my channel so that you can see my upcoming videos without further delay let's get started so let's start from the number five so from my understanding uh, the number five top five uh, career path in uh, it in 2023 is a cloud computing architect so we know that nowadays more and more companies are moving their infrastructure to cloud because first of all, it uh, provides uh, uh, zero downtime almost and beside that, uh, it saves money. For that reason, uh, you can see a lot of job uh, posting in uh, LinkedIn related to cloud computing if you are good uh, at uh, AWS, Azure, and Google Cloud because these three are the industry leader. If you are good at these three cloud uh, platform, I am pretty sure you will do fi just fine in your upcoming years because uh, the way this is emerging, the cloud computing era, uh, it will be there for uh, quite a long time. So for that reason, you can see I also got few certification from AWS, Azure and Google Cloud because this is the future. So if you are really concerned about your IT career, please get some certification and hands on knowledge related to cloud computing and try to become uh, first start uh, with the easiest easy certification and try to create a certification path and a roadmap that will help you to achieve uh, your uh, solutions architect or maybe devops or maybe sec cloud security so but anything related to cloud is very important in today's job world number four career path in my list is very interesting one it's a cyber security analyst just uh, think, whenever a bank, a financial institute, or a hospital that I assisted on a, a IT infrastructure, the main concern is like whether the data is secure, because uh, security is the major concerns for any enterprise. And if you are a security analyst, if you have experience in that field, you are all good, because. Whenever we're dealing with data, first uh, parameter is like how we are se uh, securing our data. So that's a major concerns. For that reason, uh, previously, if I want to talk about my experience, so I started as a cloud engineer. Um, I, uh, after a few years of working as a cloud engineer, then uh, one thing came to my mind that is, uh, it's always better to have at least two career uh, ca career path. So two specific skill, I meant. So for that reason, I was uh, doing well in the cl uh, cloud field. But beside that, I really wanted, I did some research and found that this uh, cyber security is always with, uh, will always be there because uh, whenever we're dealing with data, we need to protect it. For that reason, uh, I came to Canada and uh, I studied uh, my master's in uh, Information system assurance management is like 50% of cyber security and 50% of information audit. So it gave me the exposure. So once I uh, started to learn about cyber security, I just fall in love with cyber security. And after finishing my studies, then uh, this year I just cleared my CISSP and CISSP certification because I have I have the uh, passion. Like I feel like I need to learn it. And I also, if I want to think about the career perspective, if you no uh, cloud computing and cybersecurity at the same time that means you are way ahead than others so i would also suggest you guys if you get the opportunity to learn cybersecurity stuff then please go in this field because uh, this field is always uh, a better career choice 
Number three career path in 2023 is uh, data scientist. Uh, if you are good at programming and uh, data visualization, this uh, this field is definitely for you. And in these uh, recent years, the uh, way this uh, AI and other new technologies are emerging, data scientists are in a very high demand. So uh, uh, for that, you need some skill set, prior skill set, like you need to know some algorithms, you need to know uh, programming language so that you can clean the data and uh, make sure that, that your data is uh, representable. You can uh, clear your data and uh, from there you can uh, create insights that will help the business, the e-commerce or the different sort of uh, business to make uh, a better decision. So uh, if you're looking for a career field and if you're a new uh, graduate, definitely you can look for this uh, data scientist uh, career field because the opportunity is limitless. Number two best uh, career path in uh, 2023 is DevOps engineer. Uh, well, uh, DevOps engineer is a uh, very uh, great career path because in few years I have also worked as a DevOps engineer, but it was more of like cloud DevOps engineer. So you really need to know the CI/CD pipeline, continuous integration and continuous uh, delivery stuff. You need to know how to do the automation. You need to know how to write some script. Uh, if you are good at Python, not just that's really great. Then you can create your own script. Then you have to create some cron jobs too. So it requires some skill sets, but whenever there is a, a software development, DevOps are highly required. So if uh, you think like uh, you want to start your career in DevOps, uh, in uh, in IT field, DevOps engineering is definitely a very good option. And uh, the plus point is like, if you're good at uh, programming language, then definitely this field is for you. And uh, uh, if we talk about the salary range, first few years uh, i always suggest you to learn the technology to get the experience once you get like two or three years of experience in it in a devops engineer field you will earn a lot because now you're well experienced so are you excited to know about the number one career path in 2023 in it field well that is uh, artificial intelligence and machine learning engineer we all know that uh, right now it's the hottest topic because now ChatGPT is here, then uh, different companies are building their own AI. And now if you are good at this field, you will uh, definitely be benefited out of it. Um, not only just uh, AI, AI can be implemented in many sectors. For an example, uh, my previous companies where I used to work, uh, we used AI, machine learning uh, in healthcare industry. So all the time like in the operation room we are using many iot stuff and for those iot stuff we're getting a tons of information so we use the ai technology to come up with real time uh come up with real time analysis and uh, make sure the operation is uh, secure than before so in this way, the, opp the opportunity and the scope is limitless. So if uh, you are good with algorithm and uh, you like uh, to work in this field, then uh, definitely please go for this. Here you have it. So now you know exactly the top five IT carriers in um, 2023. Well, my suggestion to you, whatever carrier you choose in, in this uh, from this list, uh, Please uh, choose one career and uh, try to dig deep because uh, if you want to say like I'm expert in cloud computing or I'm expert in uh, cybersecurity, you really need to spend time. You really need to learn it. You really need to love that uh, topic because you need to be the subject matter expert, SME. Other than that, it's very hard to stand out for that reason, whatever career field you choose in IT to spend time at least uh, after spending three to five years then you can say like yes i'm an expert in this field i am working as a cloud engineer and uh, uh cyber security expert for more than eight years still i feel like i need to learn a lot i feel like I, every now and then i feel like yeah i need to um do some uh, more certification or i need to uh, try some new uh, training because in IT, it's always evolving. So whatever career path you choose, please make sure to spend at least a few hours of your 
time every day because if you do that your future version will always be thankful to you so that's all for today thank you so much guys for watching my videos it means a lot if you have any questions related to this career field that i mentioned today please let me know under this comment section and i'm gonna reply back in a very short period of time it means a lot whenever you're spending your time to watch my videos i really appreciate that and uh, uh, if you found this video helpful please like and subscribe to my channel so that uh, you can see my upcoming videos if you want me to cover any specific topic also let me know in this comment section thank you so much guys have a great and wonderful day